hello everyone welcome to the next video on uh, numerical methods uh, here we have to find out the cube root of 29 correct up to three decimal places but we have to use the numerical methods don't use the calculator okay so uh, cube root of 29 can be directly found using the calculator but we are going to found, find using the newton raphson method and chebyshev method so how you are going to find out this cube root of 29 so let us assign what is unknown value cube root of 29 so x is equal to under root 29 from this can i form the equation this a cube minus 29 is transferred to this side so it becomes a minus 29 so x cube minus 29 is equal to 0 i will for the newton raphson method it requires a first order derivative and second order derivative so we'll take the first order derivative first order derivative of x cube minus 29 is 3x square and the second order derivative is equal to 6x so uh, how to choose the initial value if the initial value is not given for the problem in newton raphson or chebyshev this is applicable for both okay uh, to choose the initial value what is the criteria f dash of x0 initial if you substitute the initial value then answer should not be equal to 0 in the first order uh, first order derivative and uh, multiplication of f of x0 and f double dash of x0 when uh, f of x and f double dash of x when x is substituted as x0 it should be greater than 0 that is positive so let us substitute when x0 is equal to 0 now we will consider x0 is equal to 0 if i substitute 0 in this equation this f of 0 will be calculated as a minus 29 f dash of 0 will be calculated as the 0 and f double dash of 0 is also calculated as a 0 okay but f dash of 0 is 0 but this should not be 0 as per the initial condition since it is not, not satisfied the above condition hence we cannot choose 0 as the initial value next let us increment this value by 1 so i will taking the initial value 1 so i will calculate f of 1 so 1 cube minus 29 will give you 28 3, 3 into 1 square will give you 3 and 6 into 1 will give you 6 see that this is coming non-zero f dash of 1 is coming non-zero but multiplication of 6 and minus 28 minus 28 and 6 multiplication is the uh, f of 1 into f double dash of 1 that is minus 28 into 6 is not a positive value it is a negative value but necessary condition is what it should be positive always always it is not required but it will give you the better result if we satisfy this condition okay this is not a necessary condition this is a sufficient condition so let us consider that x0 is equal to 2 again if we see this is satisfied but this multiplication of these two is again not a positive for f of 3 is also not possible if when we take x0 is equal to 4 f of 4 is 35 f dash of 4 is 48 and f double dash of 4 is 24 see that f dash of 4 is non-zero multiplication of these two is positive value satisfied is this given condition which is in red color so that we can use this value as the initial value so what is the formula of newton raphson method next iteration value is equal to current iteration uh, value minus f of xn divided by f dash of xn let uh, iteration number one so i will write down for iteration number one x1 is equal to uh, xn that is x0 x1 is equal to x0 minus f of x0 upon f dash of x0 so let's let's again solve this problem in tabular form so let i is the iteration number a is the initial value so what is a b b is equal to f of a f of a means f of a so if we substitute x is equal to a then it will give you a cube minus 29 so let b is equal to a cube minus 29 and i require in this formula i require f dash so f dash of x f dash of a that is will give you 3a square then if i replace this xn is nothing but my a f of xn is nothing but my b and f dash of xn is nothing but by c so it is d is equal to a minus b c this will be the formula and the uh, and we'll see what is the remark so let us consider that initial value as we chosen 4 as initial value so let a is equal to 4 so a cube minus 29 b value will comes to 35 c is equal to 3 a cube 3 a square so it comes to 48 so uh, if i substitute in this i got the 3 d is equal to 3.27083 this is my new root now this new root should be used as the initial value in the next iteration so d is 
copied to A. So D is copied to A and again I am performing the calculation that now new A is 3.27083 calculate B calculate C by substituting the value of A is equal to this value and then you will calculate that D is equal to 3.084121 then D is D is greater than D D is replaced in the A. Similarly, again 3.084121 is my new value. I am substituting in this iteration number three. That is in iteration number three, it is substituted. When it is in iteration number three, um, B is calculated, C is calculated, again D is calculated. See that. Uh, only one digit is matched between previous and previous. So we have to match the three digit. Answer should be correct up to three digit. Again, it, D, is, D is replaced in the A. So, in the fourth iteration, so if we calculate the root, I am in the fourth iteration, I am getting the value 3.072317. See, previous iteration and current iteration, uh, it matches up to correct up to three decimal places. Hence, root is calculated. So that the root is 3.072317. If you require more accuracy, again, you can go, go on the calculations. So this is using the newton raphson method. Chibeshu method is the one advanced method on the newton raphson advanced method than the root and newton raphson method. If we observe here, the first half formula is the same. But in the second half of formula, second half formula, we require f of xn square divided by f dash of xn cube okay f dash of xn cube into f double dash in the previous calculation f double dash was not there but here we have to take the f double dash how to choose the initial value in chibesha method also you have to apply this uh, uh, condition to choose the initial value okay so again what is the initial value we are getting initial value is 4 so b is equal to a cube minus 29 c is equal to 3a square this is the f of f of x this is f dash of x and this is f double dash of x so a b c d so in this formula new root e is equal to a minus b by c minus 1 by 2 b square upon c cube into d so a minus b by c minus b square into d divided by b square into d divided by 2c cube. So by using this formula, I can find out the answer using Chibesha method. So initial value is 4, b is calculated, c is calculated, d is calculated, substituting this into this equation, substituting into this equation, I got the 3.137912, then e value is replaced in a, so this e is the initial value for the next iteration that is copied in the a, same doing the calculated b, calculated c, calculated d, then again getting e, next again this approximate value is substituting in the iteration number 3, see that, after iteration number 3, I am getting e is equal to uh, previous iteration value almost how many digits are matched four digits are matched so root of the answer root of the equation is 3.70 uh, 3.072316 so see here four iterations are required and in chibesha method it is it can it is solved in the three iterations only okay so this is the advantages of chibesha method but it requires the double uh, it requires the second order derivative also in the calculation though the complexity is increases it increases accuracy of the answer and speed is increases thank you